And now your weather with meteorologist Gino Recchia. High temperatures this afternoon got up into the lower 50s, a lot cooler than just a few days ago. Remember those low 70s that we had? We're not going to be seeing that anytime soon, but we could get into some lower and mid 60s by next week. After a cool kind of middle stretch in the work week, we are going to be warming things up. Temperatures from normal have been near or slightly below average across the Midwest. Nothing too extreme, no low 40s or some upper 30s. And then moving forward, we are going to be warming up. Six to 10 day outlook for the temperature trend for the Climate Prediction Center shows the eastern part of the country expecting some warmer weather as the western half will be dealing with some cool weather across the lower 48s. Here's a look at the time lapse. Woke up this morning with some low level clouds, but look how quickly they started to disappear heading into the afternoon and it's really going to turn into a very nice, beautiful stretch going into the weekend and next week. We really don't have any rainfall as multiple rounds of high pressure will be settling in across the Great Lakes, keeping all these weak weather systems away from our neck of the woods. So really very nice and comfortable. If you got to continue to do maybe some late fall uh, lawn work or something like that, the ground's going to be dry. There's not going to be dealing with much rainfall. So a great stretch of weather to take care of any projects. Maybe I've been even seeing some people putting the Christmas lights up. Maybe it's a little bit early, but perhaps you want to do it now before it gets too cold to do it. Uh, a close look does show pretty much mostly clear skies for the rest of the evening hours. And with clear skies and calm winds, look what happens to our temperatures as you get into the morning hours tomorrow. Near and below freezing, so expecting a wide spread frost and freeze conditions. If maybe you brought out the plants that are sensitive to the cold weather when we had that nice stretch of those 70s, now you want to bring them back in because it's going to get pretty cold by tomorrow morning. Also with it, mostly clear skies showing on skycast. And then we'll have a mostly sunny day tomorrow. Now later tomorrow night, some clouds will move in here from the west, but by the morning hours on Friday, we'll be turning mostly sunny once again. And there's really no rainfall in the next seven days. This is a model forecast going all the way until next Tuesday. There might be a few little sprinkles to our west, to our south but really not much rain whatsoever. Here's your temperature planner for the day tomorrow. We'll get up into the mid 50s. Our normal high for this time of year is 53. So we're going back above average and it's kind of getting a little sad seeing how quick that high temperature average normal high will be slowly dropping quicker and quicker as we head into uh, November into December. 32 for the overnight low calm winds, mostly clear skies for tomorrow getting into the mid 50s. Light winds coming in off the lake, so lake shore communities most likely you'll top off in the low 50s for high temperatures. Afterwards, upper 50s on Friday for a sports showdown. Looks like kickoff temperatures somewhere in the upper 40s. Low 60s on Saturday and Sunday, and then for Halloween, right around 60 degrees. And then getting into the mid and upper 60s by next week, Tuesday and Wednesday with more sunshine.